Greetings and salutations, guys. Hayden here. Welcome to our surprise live sale this Monday, April 15, 2024. How is everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. Happy Monday. Hope you guys are all having a great start to your week. You had a great weekend. Um, if you're watching this live after it's already over and it's a replay, you can check down below in the description box. Items availability and their pricing will be down there. And if you guys are new to the channel or to the live sales, welcome. My name is Hayden. I'm so happy to have you here. All the sale info and rules are going to be right here floating around me. But if you can't read them that well, you can check down below in the description box as well and check that out there. But happy Monday, you guys. Oh my goodness. I'm so happy that it's not raining today. It was raining all weekend and it has been kind of cold but i think it's warming up again which is nice but yeah i hope you guys had a great weekend did anyone do any great like any thrifting or find anything good this weekend let me know also um today's giveaway is going to be one of these electronic lit removers i'm super excited that these are back in stock at daiso because these are the best i feel like these are also the best like electronic lint removers that you can buy i have bought the really expensive ones from like michael's target and like amazon they do not work as well as this this one from daiso these are the best so there we go um but let's see who is in here there's odelia hi odelia there's cloverleaf bags aka robin hi robin how are you guys doing today do you guys have a good weekend do anything fun it got kind of chilly again um this weekend i just went thrifting pretty much on saturday it was raining actually it rained pretty hard saturday and sunday um but sun yesterday i still went oh, i still went out to la to go thrifting even though it was raining um there actually wasn't too, eh, yeah, it actually wasn't too crazy. I think it might be because Coachella was this weekend and LA wasn't as intense, but th does that mean it rained in Coachella? I feel like no one talked about that if it rained in Coachella. Uh, but hi, DG House, Elaine, CF, how are we doing today? Hi, Cindy, how are you? I have my water. I only have one drink. Oh, no. I have my Diet Coke, too. I got two things. I, have, I always have a million drinks around me. Hey, Robin. It was rainy and cold over there, too, in New York. How's the weather today? Is it, is it better? It's supposed to be, like, almost 80 degrees again tomorrow. I think tomorrow's supposed to be 78 degrees. So the weather keeps going up and down. Like, this weekend... It was like in the 60s, high 50s, and then today it's in the 60s, and tomorrow it's supposed to be almost 80 degrees, so the weather is just out of control. Just had a nap. Oh, nice. How was your nap, CF? I wish I could take naps. I can never take them. Like, whenever I, if I ever try to take a nap, I just feel awful afterwards. Hi, Lourdes. How are you? How have you been? Oh, it's a bit spring-like? Nice. Yes, yeah, spring is spring is in the air. The flowers have started blooming here, too, which is really pretty. It's a little late for Southern California. I feel like um, usually, like, the flowers are, like, going crazy already. But it's been a little bit slower. Oh, it's 77 degrees there today? Nice. Here it's like 60-something. I can't believe it's actually... Yeah, the high today is 69. So I can't believe it's actually colder in California than it is in New York during this time. That's crazy. Hi, Susu. <gasps> How was your... You had that? I'm glad you had a fun weekend with your friends. Um, I leave next, a week from today is when I leave. So a week from today, um, we're going to Kauai, I think is the island. Peonies. 
Oh, I love peonies. I can't wait for the peonies to appear at Trader Joe's. I should actually go to Trader Joe's this week and see if they have any. Peonies are my favorite flower. But yeah, so I leave for Hawaii next Monday. I am not prepared. I don't know what to wear um, to the wedding. <laughs> I, I, I was, I'm just like, do I even have anything? I actually should check how hot it is in Hawaii. Because I feel like I'm going to just be melting and sweating with in whatever I wear. Uh, Hawaii. Wait, is it cold in Hawaii? Ooh, it's actually not hot in Hawaii either. Hawaii. Oh, actually, it's not that hot. That's good. It's gonna. It's the weather is kind of like the same as it is here. I thought it was gonna be like in the Philippines. I was like, Ugh, that is really warm. Oh, nice! You're going in mid May. I know. I I definitely will vlog as much as I can. Hi, Linda. Oh. Give your grandson a big little hug for us. Yay. Grandkids are the best. Okay. Ooh, speaking of flowers. It's been really rainy there past week, but shouldn't be hot. Ooh, wait, that's good. Because I'm a mosquito magnet. The mosquitoes love attacking me. What is your favorite flower? Okay, that is our giveaway question today. What is your favorite flower? I like that. I might have asked that already before, but that's okay. I love like roses. I love peonies. I love orchids. I'm a flower person for sure. I love them. I'll be in Georgia. <gasps> nice. I I think I might have been to Georgia once. Like when I was little. There's a link for the giveaway. Leave your answer to the comments right or to the giveaway question right there in the comments. And then at the end of the live sale today, we'll be announcing our giveaway winner for our electronic lint remover. Hi Sandy. Oh yeah, and if you could give the video a thumbs up, that always helps the channel immensely. And don't forget to give that video where you leave your um, answer to today's question. That was this morning's YouTube video. Um, leave your, don't forget to leave a thumbs up there as well. Hi, Marjorie. And if you haven't seen that video yet, definitely go check that out. Um, is Hawaii crowded? I've only ever been to Hawaii once. And that was uh, like years and years and years ago. So I don't even know. There were a lot of people there though. That's good to hear, Sisu. We're getting, uh, we're getting, my cousin is getting married. I think it's like in a botanical garden area. So it should be really nice. I'm really, really excited. I really want to see, I don't even know what I want. We're, um, we're going to stay there for a week. Yeah. So we, we come on a Monday, yeah, we arrive on a Monday, then we leave on a Monday. So it should be really, really fun. I'm so excited. I just need to figure out the wedding outfit and yeah, should be, should be good. I'll probably just like, end up wearing like some sort of slacks and like a button up or something. She said like, my cousin said that it it's like not formal at all. So like... Something simple. Marjorie, I've never been. Oh, airplanes are overrated. <laughs> they're stressful. <laughs> and they're too crowded. <laughs> uh, 
Ooh, Cindy, what are you making? I'm trying to think of what I should eat for lunch after the live sale. My mom made, um, she has like a couple things that she pre-made. She made chicken tikka masala and then she made like a beef stew with potatoes and carrots. And that's also really good. I kind of want to have a little bit of both. And then this morning, mom and I had a salad, which was really nice. We're on a diet for the wedding. So I'm going to Tokyo and a new salad. <gasps> no way. That sounds really fun, CF. I've always wanted to go to Japan. What are these days? I really want to visit um, that, like, Studio, like the Studio Ghibli, like, theme park. Ah, uh, so cool. And, of course, the vintage designer shopping is amazing in Japan, too. Oh, I love a good waterfall. Yes. So the wedding is going to be in the beginning of the week. And then the rest of the time that we're there after the wedding, like, we're... John, my mom, and I are just going to explore. So it should be pretty fun. I think we're also renting a car, which is going to be cool too. So we'll just be able to drive wherever we want. So that'll be fun. Okay, well, let me leave the link one more time for the giveaway. And then we can get started. Does anyone have anything fun planned for the week? <gasps> Today is the last day to turn in your taxes, so don't forget. Big Ziti. <gasps> oh, that sounds so yummy. Big Ziti is delicious. And garlic bread. Mm, mm, mm. Garlic bread sounds so yummy. I'm trying to stay away from carbs this week, though. So I have to be strong. Right? Yeah, I feel like a rental car is the way to go. My parents, whenever they travel anywhere, they always get a rental car and they love it. So that's like our new thing is getting a rental car. Unless like the um, like public transportation is really good. Like when we went to Paris, like buses and like the the train were so awesome. But... Yeah, like when we went to the Philippines recently, just getting a rental car was honestly the best thing that we've probably ever done when we've gone to the Philippines. And we've been to the Philippines so many times, first time we've ever got in a car. And it's actually so nice. Like you don't have to rely on anyone or try to like get um, like an Uber or anything. It's just so nice to just have your car handy whenever you need it. Okay, let's get started. Um, item number one is gonna be... I think we should start off with a bang. So, and I know this vid this item was in this morning's YouTube video. So, this is actually a bag that just recently came out. Um, this is the Coach Tabby. And it is the quilted Coach Tabby in black Napa leather. I love that this one has silver hardware. The silver hardware is so, so nice with this one. Um, this bag retails for like five fifty. I think it's like around six hundred dollars with tax. It is really expensive. This actually um comes with a dust bag, and it actually comes with the original receipt from purchase, and it is in like new condition. It is beautiful. So it's our black quilted coach tabby. This is a size twenty six. It has the hang tag right there. There's a nice big back pocket. This will hold the largest iPhone. It's also magnetic. This front flap pops open. There's actually a little pocket right here, also magnetic. Little compartment right there. And then there's a middle dividing zipper pocket. Yes. Oh, Nana. Yeah, there's a lot of fakes on Mercari, lots of fakes on Poshmark. This is authentic. It comes with the original receipt as well. It was purchased here in California. Uh, receipts right in here. So it is definitely authentic and it comes also with a dust bag. 
If you see any of these, like, on Poshmark and Mercari, and they're listed, like, under, like, 400 or, like, 350 um, they're probably most likely a fake. So, I actually was looking at them last night, and a lot of them have been purchased. So, just be careful. There's a lot of fakes. They're not even, like, fakes. They're just, like, fake listings that people, like, will put up. And then you're not, you're like, yeah, don't get them. So, but it's beautiful. Black leather. It's in like new condition. She's stunning. And this is going to be item number one. This is our black quilted coach tabby 26 with silver hardware with dust bag and original receipt. And this is gonna be $450, and that is gonna be item number one. Just one more look before we go on to our next item. I love that you can wear it like crossbody nicely too. So cute. Hey, Kirsten! And then you can wear it doubled up as a shoulder bag. How are you, Kirsten? <gasps> Kirsten, I'm so excited for the Bagu store to open up in LA. I'm so excited. I'm hoping that everyone's gonna be at Coachella weekend too, this weekend, <laughs> so that no one goes. Cause I don't want there to be a ton of people. But it's, yeah, it's gonna be really exciting. All right, I also heard that they're going to have, um, what is it called? Uh, like the, like older things, like they're going to have like some of like the leather stuff at the store too. So dead stock, that's what it's called. They're going to have like dead stock items at the grand opening. So I'm really, really excited. Okay, next up I have, this is a Jimmy... Chew wallet. Ah, oh, Kirsten, I wish you could come to not wallet belt. This is a Jimmy Choo belt, and it is really really pretty. It's in this purple suede leather, and then underneath, it's almost like a vachetta colored leather, and it has silver hardware. It just says Choo, like Jimmy Choo, and it's in silver with the crystals. So it's encrusted in crystals really really pretty this is a size large and it's made in Italy the belt is in a wonderful condition so so cute so Jimmy Choo belt it's our purple suede leather Jimmy Choo belt silver hardware with crystals and this is, like I said, it's in really great condition. This is going to be, how much, Adrian? And this is a size large. Wait, one more time, Adrian. Okay, we're going to do this one for, let's do $80. Eight zero. This is going to be item number two. All right, next up, we're on item number three. Kirsten, if there's anything you want me to get for you at the Bagu, Bagu opening, if I can find it, I'll get it. Just let me know. That goes for anyone. If anyone wants anything, just let me know, and I'll pick it up for you. I'm really excited. I want to get, um, hopefully, one of like the leather crescent bags in the large size. And, I don't know, um, maybe like a cute sunglass case. All right, next up, we have item number three. And for number three, I have, this is a pair of YSL sunglasses. These are actually, like, fairly new. They just came out. I think these are called the Betty. And they are large and in charge. They are in black plastic. And then they have, um, like, silver hardware. It has, like, this metal 
YSLP, like, thing that's just right there. Yeah, Kirsten, just let me know. Send me a DM. Um, they say YSL on the sides as well. And then it has, like, a silver, like, mirrored portion underneath the lenses. They're in pretty good condition. Very light marks on the, um, on the frames and on the lenses. There is kind of like a, there, there's some markings back here from where the sunglasses hit the, um, the lenses. But, yeah, very minor marks. This is how they look on. They're huge. These will definitely protect your eyes and, like, half your face from the sun. <laughs> so, this is how they look on. And this is going to be item number three. These are black, extra large, uh, YSL Betty sunglasses with silver hardware. And these are how much, Adrian? Okay, these are going to be 165 Item number three. They're fabulous. My hair is a mess. These are actually kind of fun. They actually look make my head look smaller. That's what I like about them. They're like large and in charge. All right, next up, we got item number four. We have these brand new Bally sneakers. <gasps> nice, Tanya. A three kilometer walk. That's amazing. <laughs> right, DG House? I don't know if you could really be a spy with these because they kind of like stand out, but they are wonderful. Um, These are a size five and a half. They are like brand new. Like they don't have like anywhere on them except for like where they store and mark them on the bottom. But they are in brand new condition. They have glitter, silver glitter, black suede and leather accents. And then it has like this cool like black and white uh, like checkered design. They look very sporty. They're for the Bally Vita Parkours. And these are a size five and a half. Me. Secret Service. <laughs> oh, Tanya. That is amazing, though. I need to start walking, but shopping is my cardio. This is our Bally uh, Silver Glitter Sneakers. With black leather and suede trim. They also come with the extra black uh, shoelaces. And again, they're a size five and a half. And these are how much, Adrian? Okay, we're going to do these for $55 today. That's going to be item number four. All right, next up is number five. Okay, let's do... Oh, this is such a cute little bag. This is a Kate Spade wristlet. And it's in this cream leather. And then it has these little apples. On it, the apples are like this. It's like a flocked kind of like fabric feel. And then the stems are hardware, like a metal hardware pieces. And then the little leaves are actually leather. It's super cute. It has a removable wristlet. And then it still has like the styrofoam insert right there. It has three built in card slots in the back and it has pink fabric interior lining and 
It's in pretty good shape. It just has a couple small indents on the back. It might be from just sitting on top of some of the bags that I have. But, um, and it has like a little mark right here from where it was clipped. It's almost gone. I think, I think it'll actually go away. Just gotta put a little, little, little more leather conditioner on it and massage it. But otherwise, it's in like new condition. It does remind me of like a teacher bag too. It's so cute. Little Kate Spade cream wristlet. And this is gonna be, we'll do this one for 55. And that's gonna be item number five for $55. Our Kate Spade wristlet. Next up, we have number six. Um, I have, this is a red Zadig and Voltaire. It's a double pouch crossbody bag in red leather. It has a Zadig and Voltaire hardware right here on the front. And then it actually zips around. Hi, Lady Badger. Hey, Hana. It zips around. And the zipper hardware is like in a couple different colors. It's in like a brass, silver, um, antique bronze, and like a, like a rose gold. So it's pretty cool. And these actually like open up so you can, un you unzip them and then they, expand and then inside where it expands the leather is a metallic silver so it's really really cool and that's on both sides and then you can zip them closed as well and then both of them the both of the compartments they just are open there's no pockets or anything um this also does come with the original dust bag it's nice and clean on the insides no pen marks or anything the only thing is there's a slight there's some slight rubbing on the back corners of the bag and a little bit on the bottom as well but it's very minimal and crossbody strap is adjustable but not removable hey d4 how's it going oh that's good to hear hana Okay, so this is our sixth item. This is our red Zadig and Voltaire double pouch crossbody bag with dust bag. And this one will be $95, and that's going to be item number six. Okay, next up, we have number seven. Is that the baby? <laughs> uh, next up, we have, this is a Marc Jacobs collection wallet. And it's in this black quilted lambskin leather with gold hardware. It has two little pockets here with little snaps. And then there's a zipper pocket on the front. And there's an open pocket in the back. And this holds a ton of cards. Um, it's in great shape. Just needs to be vacuumed out a little bit. It's a little dusty in there. Um, but yeah, this is Marc Jacobs made in Italy. This is collection. I believe this retailed for around 600 ish dollars. The exterior lambskin leather is in fantastic condition. It's super duper soft. The corners are in pretty good shape. Very minimal rubbing. Yeah, these the these have like the chunky zipper pulls. The hardware's in pretty good shape. There's a little bit of color loss on the hardware, like where the little um these little round parts are right there. Very mild color loss. Otherwise, the hardware is in really, really great shape. And these do open and close. These little front pockets. You push in. 
the little snaps and then these do open you can put like change inside of there and this is number seven you can even use this like as a sunglass case it's really really cute this is our black lambskin quilted leather Marc Jacobs collection wallet made in Italy and these oh this one's gonna be um let's do let's do 65 for this one 65 dollars is gonna be item number seven Sixty-five for our Marc Jacobs wallet. Okay, next up is number eight. And number eight, this is a bl uh, black. This is um, kind of like a taupe. Taupe leather Kuyana crossbody bag. It's just like a pouch style bag. The crossbody strap is removable and it is adjustable. Super cute. It's a good size in comparison to my cell phone. And on the inside, it's unlined. It just has a little Kuyana tag right there. Made in, um, I think these are made in Spain. Oh no, this one's made in Turkey. Made in Turkey. Unlined on the inside. Super clean inside and out. It looks like new. Gold hardware. And this is Kuyana. That's going to be item number um, eight. This is our taupe leather Kuyana pouch crossbody with gold hardware. And this is going to be... Let's do $60. That's going to be item number eight. Next up, we've got number nine. Oh, number nine. I have um another pair of sunglasses. Oopsie. Oh, no. I lost my little chat thing. Uh, where did you go? Okay. Number nine. I have another pair of sunglasses. These are... Gentle Monsters. I don't know how I've, how I've been finding so many Gentle Monster sunglasses recently, but these are really cool. These are the Gentle Monster sunglass collab with Tilda Swinton, and they are beautiful. They're like they're both plastic and metal. They're in like this, like almost like a nude color. Hi Melissa, how are you? This is how they look on. They're so cool. So they are gorgeous. This is how they look. These are number nine. They're in really great condition too. The frames are in really good shape. The lenses, they have like very minimal, if any, scratches on them. And they have the nose pieces, which are awesome. Oh, I'm glad you like them, Melissa. Yay. <laughs> Enjoy. That bag is so cute. I love it. Okay, so this is um, our black, or our black, this is uh, Gentle Monsters <sighs> Tilda Swinton collab with, uh, the hardware is gold. And these are... Okay, we're gonna do these for $110. That's gonna be item number nine. Oh, Melissa, I'm glad you like that bag. It's such a nice one. Okay, next we have number 10. Um, oh, okay, I have, this is a Gucci um, clutch. And it's in, it's like a, it kind of has like a metallic sheen to it. It's like a, almost like a pearlescent -y kind of like brown taupe color. 
It has a little bamboo turn lock and then a bamboo zipper pull tassel right there. It's super cute. So you turn that. This pops up. You unzip it. And then inside, it actually has a bunch of built-in card slots on one side. And then the other side, actually I can pull this out. The other side has um, it has three like lipstick pockets and then like a larger one. And then these are like the built-in card slots. And then it also has a slip pocket behind for like cash. And then the, the little tag is right there, serial number. So beautiful little fold over Gucci clutch. Oh, Linda Lobster is calling number nine. Oh, congrats, Linda. The sunglasses are so oh! cute. Soul to Linda. Congratulations. Oh! Okay, but this clutch is really cute. Again, it is Gucci. There you go. Here's the back. They're gonna look phenomenal, phenomenal on you, Linda. They're so cool. So this is our um, taupe brown leather Gucci fold over clutch with bamboo details. And um, the hardware is in gold. Gold? Or is it like silver? I can't even tell. I think it's silvery. It's like a light, light gold. Okay, we're gonna do this one for $250. It's in really great shape. All the corners are in pretty nice condition. There's like no really like obvious rubbing. Maybe a little bit on this corner. There's like a little, oh, I don't think that's, um, I think that's actually just a little dirt. Yeah, very mild rubbing on the corners and the hard, the bamboo hardware is in really good shape. That's going to be item number 10. Okay. And then next up, number 11. For number 11, I have, this is a, um, a Tory Burch. And it's a drawstring bucket bag. And it's in this blue color. It has these really cute crystals on it. They're like an opaque blue crystal with gold. It has a little top handle. The crossbody strap is removable, but it's not adjustable. And it just looks really cute on. And that's item number 11. Um, it's in, oh, it's in really good condition too. Very minor rubbing on the corners. I don't even know if they're going to show that much. Um, very minor. It's a really cute small size too, but it'll still hold a lot. Like you can still put your phone in vertically and it'll fit inside of there. The interior is also really nice and clean. It just has one pocket inside and this is going to be number 11 this is our blue quilted leather Tory birch bucket bag drawstring crossbody with gold hardware and this is going to be $110 it's going to be number 11 This is so cute. I think this bag retails around 500. 
Okay. Next up is number 12. Okay, so number 12. This is a Fossil crossbody bag. This one is so nice. Um, I didn't even know Fossil made bags in this style. And this one is actually still available online. This one retailed for like 350 I think, and I think it's, oh, two ninety five. It's currently on sale for one ninety nine. So it's this beautiful black flap bag. It's in a box style leather with gold hardware. Um, there's a pocket here in the back, and then it has a little charm right here on the side. And I love the hardware. It's like this gold piece that tucks into this leather part it's actually magnetic so it doesn't take a lot of um effort to get it to slide in it kind of just like attaches by itself with the magnets you open this up it has a beautiful black microfiber lining and then there's a compartment here there's another pocket in between right there and then there's a back zipper pocket and then there's another pocket behind that. You can definitely fit a phone inside. I have my largest iPhone. That actually fits inside horizontally. And it also fits inside vertically. Just pops up a little bit in the back. And you can fit that phone into the back as well. But it kind of just pops up. And I don't know if... Yeah, it's, I don't think it's going to fit in horizontally. Maybe if I took off the case... But it's a beautiful bag, black leather. The crossbody strap also is adjustable. And then this is how it looks on. Such a cute bag. And that just like slips. I, I love the way that the hardware works. It's beautiful. Hey, Dee Dee. And this is number 12. This is our black fossil flap bag with gold hardware. And this is... I'm going to do 75 on this one. That's going to be item number 12. And it's in a wonderful condition. There's, like, really no marks on the other. It's called the Lennox um, crossbody bag. So that's number 12. Dee Dee, I have to show you. I think you I think you might have this bag, do you? I know some of you guys have forgot. But in a, in denim, do you have this in denim? I don't remember. But this bag is still pretty. It's a coach tabby. Quilted tabby in silver. Ugh, it's gorgeous. I'm like obsessed with this. Alright, so that was number twelve. Number 13 is next. Oh, Lady Badger's call number 12. Ah! Congratulations, Lady Badger. Sold to Lady Badger, number 12. Hi, Jana. Oh, you do have it? Nice. I knew you did. I think someone else has it too. Um, is it Levon? I think Levon has it, right? Is it? Is, does she have the one with the lips? How are you, Jana? I know it's been so long. Um, I'm asking for fifty for it. It comes with a dust bag and the original receipt. I wish it wasn't so expensive. I like, <laughs> I was like, if no one likes it, I'm just going to keep it for myself because it's such a nice bag. So I wasn't like, I was like, okay, it's such a, like, it looks like a Chanel. When I first saw it, I thought it was a Chanel bag. Like, it's so chic. Yeah, I knew Levon had it. It's so cute. I'm just going to wear it for a hot second. I like it. It's just like, it's really comfy. All right. 
13. Ooh, I have another coat. This one is a vintage guy. If you guys remember what it is called, please let me know. I don't remember. Um, black leather. This one is made in Turkey. We got the little top handle. We got the crossbody strap. Brass hardware. It is missing the original hang tag. So I don't have that. All the corners do look pretty good though. <gasps> Elaine, nice. The gold hardware is so classic. Ah, oh, thank you, Elaine. This is the Coach Court. Thank you so much. It has a nice big back pocket right here. Turn lock. There's um a pocket here in the front. And then inside, it just has one zipper compartment. And inside is nice and clean. It's unlined. How do you like your tabby, Elaine? Did you also, is it also the size 26? I think it comes in a larger size too, right? She is a beauty. Okay, so that is our black coach court. Black coach bag made in Turkey. And this is how much, Adrian? Okay, we're going to do... Ah! Oh, no. Black coach core bag made in Turkey. 90 There you go. $90. I'm hoping Mother's Day will bring me a gold one as well. A <laughs> nice DD. I hope so, too. 2633 was too big. The 33 is pretty big, huh? I feel like this is the perfect size, 26. Ooh, that's that leather is soft. Uh Michelle, for this one, it depends on where you are. Shipping will be either 10 or 15 dollars extra. But you can buy up to five items and then we'll ship it for underneath that $15 shipping fee. But it's uh it's either ten or fifty dollars. If you're with if you're like what's the limit, Vadrian? Like, is it like Texas? Yeah, it really depends on where you are. I know I'm obsessed with the Napa leather too. Yeah. Okay, so that was number 13. Oh, now I have... Okay, like, I, I'm still obsessed with this one, too. My little fur tabby. I'm like, this one is... So, so cute. <gasps> can you imagine? I can attach this to this and then it'll be like, it'll be like a little charm. So cute. Ugh. Now I'm going to have like these two bags attached to me. I still can't believe I got these <laughs> <laughs> These bags are so new, especially this, um, this blue one. Like, this one just came out, too. I think that this one was purchased in November, was when this one was purchased on the receipt. Yeah, it is the little Nas collab. Isn't it so cute? <gasps> yeah, we're gonna call him Cookie Monster, because that is, like, such, the, like, the perfect name for it. I want this in like all the colors because it's so cute. But yeah, this one's not for sale, unfortunately. I, I gotta keep this one, at least for a while. I'm like too obsessed with it. It's so cute. Okay. No, I don't think so. 
I don't know. Speed train. All right. Next up. Lady Badger, I'm, like, so jealous of how much fun you guys had. I'm so jelly. It is 007. Isn't it so cute? This one's not for sale, though, unfortunately. I'm keeping this one for at least a little while. It's, like, one of my favorite little bags at the moment. You guys know how much I love a tiny bag, so... Gotta keep that one for a little bit. Okay, next up, we have number 14. And for 14, we have... We have another coach. This is a coach, Cassie. And this is in, like, an off-white um, color. And gold hardware. We got the hang tag right here. It has a little chain shoulder strap <laughs> I am just covered in coach bags at the moment uh, there is a back pocket right here turn lock opens up and inside we got front pocket the main compartment has a zipper and there's another back pocket and it's nice and clean on the inside the exterior is in great shape as well the hardware is pretty good, just very light marks. <gasps> 007! <gasps> Hawaii? I'm just scared of it, like, getting sand in the fur. Ooh, what bag am I going to take to Hawaii? I feel like I can't take too much stuff with me because um, I think we can only take, like, a carry-on. Like... Unless we check something in. But I think that's extra. But I think we will check in like one luggage. Between the three of us. And then everything else is going to be a carry on. Uh, but this is the Coach Cassie. Uh, wonderful condition. The leather on the exterior is in really great shape. And this is going to be item number 14. Our off-white leather Coach Cassie. With gold hardware. And this is how much better? Okay, then we're going to do a flat 100 on this one. It's going to be item number 14 for our coach, Cassie. I feel like this is also, like, the perfect blank canvas to paint something on. <gasps> it would be so pretty with something cool on it. Totoro? I want to just paint Totoro on everything. I'm obsessed. Okay, so that's our coach, Cassie. Oh, I got to show you guys <laughs> the update on the pouch that I've been bejeweling. It's not that much. I only did a little bit more, but it's so cool. I can't wait to get the whole thing done. Vadrian, leave me alone. It does not look the same. When I first showed you guys, it was only like up to here. I added like an extra inch. Vadrian is my bully. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> thank you, Dee Dee. Okay, next up, we have number 15. And, oh, I still have this guy. So this is um, another Gucci bag. This is the Gucci flap bag, flap messenger. Um, Lauren, no. The black quilted coach bag was, um, was item number one. This is the coach court bag was number 13 was this one. So this one was number 13. This item, this one was number one. This one is, um, this one was 450 for the coach tabby. This is the coach court. And this one is $90. Oh, no, I didn't open it yet, um, Purse Creator. <laughs> I'll open it right now, actually. It'll be fun. Oh, after, um, I'll show on this one first. Let me show this one first, then we'll open the box that you sent me. Purse Creator sent me something so I can work on it. 
Um, it was super sweet of her because we were talking about um, bejeweling something in another live like a few weeks ago. And she sent it to me and I can't wait to open it. And then we're going to see, uh, we're going to bedazzle it. It's going to be beautiful, but probably after I come back from Hawaii. So this is item number um, 15. Also, you guys got to give Purse Creator a follow and Lady Badger. They do lives here on YouTube as well. And they sell purses and they're amazing. We love them. And Cloverleaf Bags also is a reseller as well. You got to follow them also. That's Robin. So Cloverleaf Bags, Dee Dee, and Purse Curator, and um, Lady Badger. So, and Dee Dee, she's like, she's on a roll. She's been doing some really fun videos. So you guys have to check those out. But this um, Gucci is in really great condition. It does have like a slight scent to it, like a perfumey, almost like a baby wipe kind of scent um but it's not unpleasant it is really mild um cloverleaf bags oh cloverleaf bags is calling item number 14 <laughs> 14 is going to you and that was our off-white coach cassie congratulations I need to set these guys aside. Okay. Um, Gucci. So it's a really great condition, like I said. The leather is... The only wear, really, is the little... Where the magnets are on the bag. It has a little bit of rubbing where the leather is. Um, there's a zipper pocket inside and then two open pockets. That's going to be item number 15. So this is our tan canvas monogram Gucci flap bag with brown leather trim and silver hardware. And this is $500. It's going to be item number 15. And then now we're going to open the bag that, um, that purse creator sent me to Bejewel. It's going to be so fun. The package is so cute, too. <laughs> it has um, a little Mickey Mouse sticker that says, Hiya, pal. I'm not even going to do my really bad Mickey Mouse impersonation that Adrian hates. Or am I? Oh, boy. Yeah, too late. I did it. <laughs> I used to do it for Eliza all the time when he was a baby, and he enjoyed it. Adrian is just jealous. Let me, can I say hiya, pal? Huh? <laughs> Chris is like, do it, do it. It's <laughs> now I'm embarrassed. I'm gonna turn even more red. I'm like, um, I used to be like, oh boy, hey Lizo, it's me, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, hi, Pamela. See, Dee Dee said it was a good impersonation. Thank you, Dee Dee. Vadrian is just a hater. Purse Creator, you did such a good job packaging this. Vadrian is just mad because your baby will, will never hear my impersonation. <laughs> nope. Ah, first creator, you're such a gifted rapper. Ah, uh, here's the bag. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful coach. I believe this is the the Robinson mini flap crossbody bag, and it's in tan with gold hardware. Nice, obsessed. We got the hang tag and stuff, or the hang tag, the crossbody strap inside. So we're going to bejewel this. It's going to be fantastic. Um, I forgot what colors we were supposed to do it, but we will do this when I get back. It's going to be really, really cute. Thank you for sending this over. It's going to be so, so cute, Chris Creator. Thank you. I thought I was... Thank you, Kirsten. Vadrian's just mad. <laughs> 
Vader is just bad because your Peppa Pig impersonation isn't as good as mine either. <laughs> but thank you, Prince Peter. No, my B York impersonation is better. It is Dee Dee. It's a little Tory Birch. Okay. I used to try to do so many impersonations for my nephews when I when they were little. Like <laughs> it was my life. <laughs> she said how fun, Vadrian. <laughs> Kirsten. Yeah, I'm gonna have so much fun for his creator. Thank you so much. I'm definitely gonna like make a video. I'll show you guys updates. Um, it's going to be awesome. All right. Uh, 16. We don't have too many more items left. Just a few more. But if anyone has any questions about anything, please let me know. Let me actually leave the link again, too, for the giveaway. Because we're giving away another one of these electronic um, lit removers. These are the best ones. I feel like, honestly, the best ones on the market. These are my favorite. They're the ones from Daiso. They are superior to all others that I've used, and I have used many a lit remover, and those are the best. There's that link for the giveaway. Leave your answer in the comments of that video, and then at the end of the live today, we're going to be picking our giveaway winner. Uh, okay, but next up is going to be item number 16, and it is this Claire Vivier bag. It is in black Nubuck leather with gold hardware. It is fantastic. It's in really, really great condition. Black Nubuck leather, gold hardware. The crossbody strap is removable. It has the little top panels right here, perfect for carrying in your hand or in your arm right there. It doesn't go up to your elbow, though. It's not long enough. Or, I mean, shoulder. Unless you have a really small arm, which I do not. And the inside is in this uh, chambray fabric lining. There's just one zipper pocket in the inside, and it's nice and clean in there. These are made in the USA. These are actually made locally in California, in Los Angeles, and we love that. And that's going to be item number 16. This is our black Claire Vivier Nubuck leather tote bag with gold hardware and this is $95 <laughs> I was almost going to do a Mickey Mouse impersonation again Vedrian I'm going to do it when Eliza comes home Look at Eliza do you remember when I used to do my Mickey Mouse impersonation <laughs> now Vadrian's trying to do Eliza, the Eliza impersonation. Okay, next up, we got number 17. And let's do... Okay, I have another coach bag. This one is really, really cool. This one is also, like, in brand new condition. And this is a Coach, uh, it's Coach Rainbow backpack, and it is in the rainbow monogram. And then it has golden brown leather trim, gold hardware. I love the straps; they're like a rainbow. So so cute. They're fully adjustable. It does also have the special Coach Rainbow hang tag right there as well. And there's a little front pocket right there with a little magnetic flap. And then top flap is also magnetic. There's a drawstring. It still has like most of the original packaging on it too. It has like all of the styrofoam stuff. The original, this is like the original stuffing that was inside of the bag as well. Um, there's a zipper pocket on the inside. It still has a little silica gel packets in there as well. And then there's a open pocket. And it just has this, um, it's like a maroon colored fabric interior lining. And 
that is our coach mini backpack. This is in the rainbow. So cute. It has a leather base on the bottom. So nice. Yeah, it's in pretty great condition. Is that a mark? Oh no, it's just a smudge. Someone's finger. Yeah, it's in really, really great shape. It's pretty much brand new. And this is going to be item number 17, our Coach Rainbow um, Monogram Mini Drawstring Backpack with Brass Hardware, new without tag. It does have um, the care booklet and stuff, just not the original tags inside. And this is going to be how much painters? Okay, this one's $125. It's going to be number 17. Baseball season is full swing as well as any year. Swift as you saw. Be missing a lot of lives. Oh my gosh, Dee Dee. You sound like a busy bee. And I, and I, oh, your car broke on Saturday? No! That's awful. Do you know what happened? Like, what? Like, ugh. What, cars? are the worst. I wish we didn't need to have cars. <laughs> she could just teleport places. Okay. But that was item number 17 as our coach rainbow backpack. We just put all that stuff in back inside. It's such a cute bag. Oh no, fuel pump. I have no clue. That I am thinking that's how you get the fuel into the engine, but I don't know anything about cars. 18 is next. For 18, I have this metallic coach wallet on a chain. This is in a metallic red. It's kind of like a terracotta red color. It's a soft piano leather. We've got the chain cross body strap. We have a little wristlet. Both are removable. There's a back pocket right there. We've got the turn lock front right here. This pops open. You got a open, you got a pocket in the front. And then you have a middle dividing zipper pocket for like perfect for change. It's nice and clean. There's built-in card slots in the back, and then there's a nice big slip pocket there. This will hold the largest iPhone inside also, and you can remove the crossbody chain and wristlet, and you can just use this as a clutch or a large wallet. And this metallic color is really, really pretty. You won't lose this wallet inside of your bag, that's for sure. It'll like glow inside of there. And that is going to be item number um, 16, 18. So this is our metallic red Safiano leather wallet on chain with brass hardware. And this is number, or this is going to help you? Okay, we're going to do 65 on this one. That's going to be item number 16 or 18. It's in really great condition inside and out really pretty color i love metallics okay 19 is next i think we're just gonna have two more items left number 19 is gonna be this madewell satchel like hobo bag it's in brown tan and orange it does have a few small marks. There's a little mark right there on the tan part. And then another little mark right there kind of next to it on the orange part. Otherwise, though, the bag's in really great shape. It has a crossbody strap, which is removable and adjustable. The top handle is long enough to carry on your shoulder, which is fantastic. It has a magnetic snap up at the top. And it just has one interior pocket right inside of there. And the inside is unlined. 
and is nice and clean inside of there. And this is going to be item number 19, our Madewell Tricolor Satchel in brown, orange, and tan with gold hardware. And this is going to be how much, Adrian? Okay, we're going to do this one for $45. That's going to be item number 19. Okay. And then we have one more item. It's going to be item number 20. And it's going to be this little guy. This is our Simon Miller little baby. Oh, Lakenna is calling number 19. Congratulations, Lakenna. Number 19. That bag is so cute. Sold. Little made well. So beautiful. And this is our Simon Miller little mini bag. It's in light blue leather. It has these beautiful white ceramic handles. And these, even the hardware is in like that white ceramic as well. It just does have the silver backing to the hardware that you can see right there. The crossbody strap is removable. And it's slightly more, it's slightly adjustable. You can make it a little bit shorter, a little bit longer than what it is right now. And it's unlined. Um, it says Simon Miller made in France underneath it's embossed and then the inside it says it at the very bottom it has um a black leather base and it says simon miller made in france inside of there and like i said it's unlined and this will kind of hold the largest iphone it kind of just sticks up at the top though like that but still holds it and it's really cute. it's just a little like a bucket bag like a little mini one so this is going to be our last item for the day. Let me pull my scissors. Oh, my my scissors are the Eiffel Tower. Aren't they so cute? I got these from Target. Like, actually, I got it from the Goodwill, like, years ago. But it, you can actually buy them at Target. Um, And this is number 20. This is our light blue leather Simon Miller mini bucket bag with white ceramic hardware and this Simon Miller bag how much for you okay we're gonna do 75 we had it at 85 we're gonna do a little discount on this one today that's gonna be 75 Ugh, it's okay DD cars are unfortunately important <laughs> Okay, $75. Number 20 is our Simon Miller in light blue. I'm going to leave the link one more time for our giveaway as well. And... <gasps> Hi, Purple Rain. Congratulations. Number 20 is going to you. Gold. Hi, Purple Rain. Okay. Oopsies, there we go. <gasps> Purple Rain, did you see my new coach bag? This was number one. This is the coach pillow tabby with silver hardware. She's stunning. This one was number one, if you're interested. Um, <gasps> I know you like sun you're a sunglass fan too. We got these beautiful YSL sunglasses, extra large. These are the YSL Bettys. The Betty sunglasses in black. The bottoms are mirrored, but you don't really see them that much. Like the mirroring up. Oh, you can see it like that. Do you see that? Like it's like a silver mirrored part. Right? It's in like new condition. Someone please buy this and take it off my hands because I cannot hoard it. But it's such a... Oh, Susu, thank you so much. Yes, that would be amazing. I don't know anything about Hawaii, especially um, Hawaii. I think when we went to Hawaii before, when we were when, when I was younger, we went to Maui. So, yeah, that would be amazing if you could rent it, recommend any places in Hawaii. All right, did I leave the link? Oh, the, this, here's the link for the giveaway again. Sorry, I got sidetracked.
There we go. Does anyone have anything else planned for today? Also, again, I'm going to that Bagu um, grand opening on Friday. If anyone wants anything, let me know, and I'll try to get it for you. I'm super excited. <laughs> I'm like, ah, Bagu! Another store for me to cra go crazy over. Okay. But... Oh, and if anyone has any questions about anything, um, let me know if you want to see anything else or measurements or anything. Um, what else was I going to say? Um, and if you're watching this video after it's already over, you can check down below in the description box. Items availability and their pricing will be down there. And... Oh, yeah. Is anyone else going live today? Is anyone else doing any other live sales? Let us know. The day is still young. It's only lunchtime here. I'm like... Ugh, I'm starving, actually. I can't wait to find something to eat. Ooh, Lady Badger, what time tonight? Are you doing a live? Also, if anyone has any recommendations for what to wear to the wedding, please let me know because I have no clue what I'm going to wear. I need to like go through my closet and see if there's anything, um, if there's anything that, ooh, you guys, lady, give Lady Badger a follow because, it's, especially if you're not following her already, because she's going to do a live tonight. And is it, oh, a coach sale? Oh, <gasps> nice. All right, we're going to pick our winner in three, two, one, do, 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 do. Our winner is Dee Dee. Favorite flower is tulips in any color. Oh, I love tulips too. Congratulations, Dee Dee. You are the winner of our electronic lint remover. These are the best. Yeah, I was thinking about wearing linen. I don't have anything linen though, so I'm going to have to go shopping. <laughs> but tonight at 9 p.m., um, Central Standard Time, I think, yeah, 9, oh, where'd you go? 9 p.m. Central Standard Time, Lady Badger is having a live, so give her a follow and join her live sale tonight. It's going to be so much fun. Lady Badger is the best, and you can see her beautiful new hairdo, her new hair. So, yay! What time is that for me? 8? Is that 8 p.m.? I think it's 8 p.m. for me. But, um... Congratulations again to Dee Dee. You definitely do need one of those. They are the best. They're my favorite ones. Um, thank you everyone for hanging out with me today. Again, if anyone has any questions or anything, just send me an email. Invoices should be sent out within the next 15 minutes. And that is it for today. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, great rest of your week. Um, and I'll see you again very, very soon. <laughs> have a good nap, Dee Dee. All right, you guys. I'll see you all later. Adios. I'm going to go have lunch. Love you guys. Bye.